The first subject is rejected exam questions. <laughs> History. Did I delete it? <laughs> if cycling 10 miles a day uses up 400 calories, explain why Boris Johnson is still a fat bastard. <laughs> The sun is 93 million miles away. How can that cost £32 in an Uber? <laughs> Where is Greece? Is it A, the southern Mediterranean, or B, up shit creek? <laughs> what does the French phrase déjà vu literally translate as? <laughs> Using examples of Michelangelo's work, write 500 words on why he was the best turtle. <laughs> what does the French phrase déjà vu <laughs> literally translate as? <laughs> Question A. Media studies. Is it a real subject? <laughs> Question B. Is it... <laughs> Using a compass and ruler, draw perfect cock and balls. <laughs> Is this a rhetorical question? <laughs> you may now commence your anal sex exam. Please turn over. <laughs> <clears throat> Explain how UKIP became a major force in British politics without using the word wanker. <laughs> if Jay-Z is unfortunate enough to have a problem with a bitch, how many problems does Jay-Z now have? <laughs> <laughs> Aggravated violence, question one. Why might you use a bit of rubber hose pipe? <laughs> no marks. <laughs> What colour is this dress? White and gold or black and blue? Discuss. <laughs> if a train leaves a station at the correct time and arrives at its destination at the correct time, how cool would that be? <laughs> <laughs> Chemistry. Me, you. Is there any? <laughs> OK, the next topic is... Unlikely things to say when running for US president. Hillary Clinton, and if you elect me the first female president of the United States, I promise you that on my first day in the White House, I will hire a very attractive male intern. He will be on his knees, not having sexual relations with me all day. <laughs> hashtag payback, hashtag long game. <laughs> I want to go to Washington. Why? I want to see what color the White House is. <laughs> No, we can't! <laughs> <laughs> the name Clinton is in the DNA of the White House. In fact, the DNA of Clinton on the walls of the White House. <laughs> I know the value of family because I sold one of my children to pay for this campaign. <laughs> As president, I will welcome immigrants. Because the White House is massive and it's not going to clean itself. <laughs> <laughs> I will govern for all of this country. Not just the metropolitan cities on the coast, but also you cousin shaggers down south. <laughs> I would like to introduce you all to my new Homeland Security Advisor. Say hi, Lamb Chop. Hi. <laughs> Come on, of course I'm the guy to succeed Obama. You know what they say? Once you go black. <laughs> uh, 
If you elect me America's first colorblind president, I will do everything I can to uphold the values of the brown, white and green. <laughs> I would now like to talk to you people in a language of my own devising. <laughs> I want to put more boots on the ground in Afghanistan and also two more branches of paper chase. <laughs> what you must remember is the people we need to convince are the great American people. And most of them are as thick as pig shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'd like to apologize for Mr. Trump, which is what I say when I've just farted in bed. <laughs> <laughs> when I was little, I did not plan to be president of the United States. This is more like a holding job until I get to rule a good country. <laughs> I am American through and through. Cut me, and I will shoot you in the face. <laughs> I wish to have no secrets in this campaign. I wish to be completely open, and that is, done. That is why. I'm going to start that again, because I fucked that up. <laughs> <laughs> we Republicans want to reach out to all Americans. Blacks, whites, Chinesey-looking ones. <laughs> I want to have no secrets in this campaign, and that is why I have gathered you here tonight to tell you I shot gay JFK. Okay, give it up round of applause for Ed Turn Andy.